Hey guys, I'm Augie Kim from Tactical Night Vision Company. So, uh, we've got here um, the TNVC PBS 14 PBM powered bridge mount. So, what it is, it's basically a bridge system for the PBS 14. Uh, but what makes it different from a standard bridge mount is the fact that it replaces the batteries of the individual PBS 14s with these battery inserts here. And it's got a threaded cap so that you can retain. The uh, battery ca caps, so it's a total drop-in retrofit, and then also it uses two points of contact to maintain stability and alignment of those PBS 14s. So, the power bridge mount, you know, is is wired to this central hub here, so the whole thing is controlled with the single power knob there. You don't have to mess with the individual PBS 14s. Uh, in order to get them both to turn on, which really deals with one of the major downfalls of bridge PBS-14 systems. Uh, the other thing that, that we've done is we've added this auxiliary battery pack connector to it, so you can run it from uh, any Anvis low-profile battery pack, the Adams Industries, AB Night Vision. Um, you can run them all off the external battery pack, which greatly improves the uh, the the battery life of, of the PBS 14s. So, you know, I personally and, and we in TNVC, you know, we spent a lot of time kind of explaining to people the pros and cons of bridge PBS 14s versus dedicated binos. You know, the one thing that, that you know, we, we continue to make clear, even though we've released the, the power bridge mount, is that PBS, you know, you're better off going with a dedicated set of binos. Um, if you need the ability to split them up into two separate monoculars, the AB Night Vision Mod 3, which we also build and we also carry, uh, has that capability as well. The reason that we designed the PBM was really based on uh, organizational requests for some way to get binocular capability out of PBS 14s that they already had in inventory. So we're talking about conventional military, um, you know, Army Infantry, Army National Guard that already has PBS 14s, law enforcement. Um, a lot of these devices are coming through uh, DRMO these days. Um, and unlike P customers in the civilian market who can just sell their PVS-14 and, and convert to a set of dedicated binos, uh, those kinds of organizations, you know, can't just get rid of the PVS-14s. Um, so we came up with a powered bridge mount as a solution to offer that some sort of binocular capability to uh, conventional military and law enforcement, but obviously, you know, it's also, uh, it could be applicable to the civilian market.